friends i don't know what day we're up to i just wake up it's like 8 30 i'm like a solid sleep in it's really good i'm at michelle and johnny's house now i got here last night and they're both at work so i'm just like chilling and about to have me some breakfast i've just got like plain soaked oats because i didn't buy any yogurt and strawberries but strangely enough i like soaked oats anyway so it's fine um but anyway i'm gonna stop talking to you now because i look so fucked <laughs> Okay, so I've showered, put my face on. I look less like a swollen animal because I've eaten so much crap. My skin is horrible. Like, there are pimples everywhere. And also, tune out male followers, watchers, viewers. I got my period today and it's only been 12 days since I last finished my other one. So technically, I should have only just finished ovulating and now I have another period. And it's just not what I signed up for, let me tell you that much. Not what I signed up for at all. So that's really kind of annoying. Yeah, I feel a bit ripped off, a bit cheated, but that's fine. That's two periods in a month, nice. Guess we gotta make up for lost time, not having a period for seven years. But you know, that's, well, a regular period for seven years. But that's, that's fine, no worries. Anyway, just wanted to tell you something really funny. So I slept in this bed last night. Cool, great, fabulous. And um, I actually slept on the top sheet because it was tucked in so well that I didn't see that there was indeed a top sheet there. So like, look how well this bitch is tucked in. Like, wow. Shout outs to either Johnny, Michelle, whoever made this bed. Can tuck in very well. So I didn't see the top sheet there. Slept on it like it was a normal sheet. And that is my life. Anyway, it's about 10 o'clock, so I'm probably gonna head out in a brief moment. I'm gonna go to Lush and get myself some face scrub from their samples because I didn't bring any face scrub and I have eaten so much oil and my skin is breaking out so ridiculously that I need like a scrub really bad. And I don't wanna buy one because I have two bottles of like scrub at home, so I don't need any more. So I'm just gonna go get myself a sample pack and um, yeah, and then I'm gonna go to, I think it's Nalini's Whole Food or something and get another sundae. I know, I just, all I eat is ice cream, but that's fine. It was like my favorite childhood thing, like ice cream, one of my favorites. I liked everything as a child, like everything that was processed and sugary. I was all about that life. I have gone on quite the tangent for too long now, but anyway, I'm gonna head off soon. Hopefully I can lock up Johnny and Michelle's place nicely because you know how sometimes like locks are funny? I don't know, I get really stressed and I'm still rambling. Oh my God. You know how I was like, oh, I probably like, hopefully we'll be able to sort out the key to the front door. I can't unlock it. Like it just, cause I just thought I'd give it like a quick try before I left and I don't know why I bothered, but I literally cannot. It doesn't, I'm turning it both ways and it's not moving like at all. Why do I suck so much with doors? I need like simple opening doors and like turning this and like it's not locking or unlocking. And it's the right key for the door because I needed it to get out. I don't understand. It's fine, everything's fine. shops and adventuring okay so i went to lush because i wanted to get a face scrub so i got myself a face scrub a sample it's like this it's really quite good it was a cup of coffee so it can be used as like a face mask and a face scrub so i just got like, like a little sample pack thing because like i said i've got so many face scrubs at home i didn't want to buy one i also because it's brendan's birthday soon by the time you've seen this it should have already been his birthday um, but i saw this it's called five o'clock whistle and it's called a shaving smoothie but it smells like you know those coca-cola lolly bottle things that you can get they're not vegan but they're like it smells like pepsi slash coca-cola and i just thought it was really cool because like obviously brennan shaves his head and his face and everything so i was like what if i get bang one of these so yeah i just started getting this as like a little something to go along with his birthday gifts and i also got two birthday cards from typo and some wrap like a bag 
for his gift. And then I also got some thing, white chocolate from Coles, which they had on sale. And I got my Kingland Greek yogurt as well, which is in the fridge at the moment. And then I also got these two H2 cocoa chocolate drinks. Yeah. Uh, and yeah, that was my shopping trip. Well, I said I went for lunch was really like super good. Like I was just planning to go there and get the ice cream, but like their whole menu looked super, super good. And it was really quite affordable. Like I paid 13 90 for the wrap that I got and it was so, so yum. It was like so good. Um, and I also bumped into Funky Forest Food that I've been following on Instagram for like my entire life. So it was super random. She was like talking to me and she was like, oh, what's your Instagram? And like, she like had logged out of her Instagram thing and I saw like her Instagram name like as she was logging in and I'm like pretty sure I follow you and yeah super strange like such a small world but it makes sense now because I remember seeing her post about there and obviously because she works there that's why she's posting about it and yeah I think now I'm just gonna like edit some videos and just chillax because I feel bloated and disgusting yay for being a woman sorry it's a few hours have passed but I basically spent my afternoon editing videos then I took a 40 minute nap and then I continued to edit videos work on the phone to Brendan and um, Michelle and Johnny came home from work and then we had dinner pretty late but it was so good uh, Michelle made like some black beans and there was some brown rice and some lettuce and roasted cauliflower it felt so good to have like some super healthy like wholesome food really needed that so I've eaten pretty well today so it's pretty good about 11 30 so I should probably go to bed I'll see you tomorrow good morning friends what a sight to see I'm face masking with that stuff that I got from Lush yesterday it's like really really good today's plans this morning I had my oats in bed for breakfast and I've just been editing videos and like relaxing. For lunch, I'm gonna go to a place called, I think it's like the Fruitologist or something. And they do like these acai bowls and they look amazing. So like, we don't really have any in Adelaide that match that sort of aesthetic. So it's kind of why I'm going there. <laughs> so I'm gonna make my way out to Bondi to go to there and get that for lunch. And then I'll probably just come back here and like relax again because I don't know, I just feel like relaxing. And tomorrow, um, I think I've got a bit of a busier day planned. I'm catching up with two friends. So yeah, today will be like my last day of sort of just relaxing before two days of spending time with friends and then going back home so why not get some videos edited get that all done so that way i don't have to worry about it and i want to do like a places to eat in sydney as a vegan sort of video which is what i'm working on at the moment and then i also i might do some reviews on my blog and stuff like that and on zomato because i really like to review places that i go to i'll see how much i can get done today yeah that's the plan jen so i'll check in with you later when you travel 43 minutes and get on two different buses just for acai <laughs> I just got home from being out and shopping and fooding and that acai bowl was like the best acai bowl ever it was like ten dollars and as you saw it was huge and it was like yeah basically a meal and a cup but i'm hungry already <laughs> so i made a bowl of oats and yogurt we also had like this sale on loving earth chocolate like the two new flavors so i got those as like a little thank you gift for michelle and johnny and then i also got cards like more cards i got like two thank you cards one for michelle and johnny and then the other for chelsea and then like h&m had a sale so i got some track pants from there they were ten dollars no they were fifteen dollars and then i got some loose light black pants as well they were ten dollars and yeah that's what i got and i got a kombucha as well where is that oh here yeah. it's not the greatest but it was nice for something different and it was only like three dollars so I was okay with that. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna eat these oats now and do some stuff on the computer and mum's probably gonna call me soon as well and we'll have a chat. So once again, it's been hours and I haven't filmed anything for the vlog. Oh my God, I'm hopeless. For this afternoon, I took another nap. That's what my life is now. I just go and I eat food and then I take a nap. <laughs> oh my God, I am a potato. But yeah, I don't know, I've just been like super tired lately. I'm not really sure, maybe it's like poor diet and I ate really well today though fam. Poor diet and like period stuff maybe. Maybe like a hormone thing. Maybe because I keep going to bed so late because it's like 11 o'clock right now. It's almost 11.30 actually to be honest. But tonight for dinner, um, Michelle made like this corn chowder. It looked like fucking shit. But oh my god, it smelt and it tasted amazing. Like I got like a rough recipe from her and I'm going to try and make it myself because like oh my god, it tasted so good. It tasted kind of like pumpkin soup and then like you pair it with rice. Oh my god. And then after dinner, um, I washed the dishes. Fucking Brendan went to Terry Darling's, which is like a bakery in Adelaide. And he organized them to make him some monstrosity of a burger challenge thing. And he did like a live stream of him eating it. And so I watched that and that went for about 40 minutes. <laughs> but it was the funniest thing ever. But yeah, he smashed down like this huge burger. I'll put a photo of it so you can see, but like it was ridiculous. And then 
I chatted to him on the phone for a bit after that and did a bunch of like reviews on zomato.com because I like to review places that I eat at so I went through and like reviewed all the places that I've eaten at in Sydney and yeah that was my afternoon and night and I've also had like four bowls of oats today because I had three as snacks because I've just been so ravenous I don't know what's happening but I'm so hungry all the time but I'm gonna go to bed now and I'll check in with you guys tomorrow and hopefully tomorrow's a little bit more exciting but I've had really good days like just hanging out by myself and just doing what I want but it's probably not that interesting for you guys but I'm having a really good time and I don't want to go back home because that means I have to go back to work but I do want to go back home because I miss Brendan and I miss my food I'll see you guys tomorrow <laughs> Oh, <laughs> oh,